Maybe this isn't what you typically envision, Get up, yeah. but this is what chasing your dream looks like. Uh, one more. Ah. Yeah, it's grueling, it's lengthy, some days are just way harder than others. Cameron Metcalf keeps it very basic, just stay the course. Man, I'm working towards to be able to just 20 years from now not, not have to work. Not have to work for not only me, but for my family. So now mix that mindset with his game. Hold it down, we almost finished. That's why he's got a scholarship to play at Columbia University. That's why he was Dr. Phillips' first ever three-year captain. It's not something you really think about. You do it for, to help the guys around you because you know that you can help them, you're helping yourself. Go, alternate, go up. This is a man on a mission. It's just a testament, I feel like, to my family. And it starts right at home. For me to just keep going and keep pushing, and you know, in the end, I, I did it and did it for my family. For his brother and best friend, Caden, I'm gonna miss him. You're gonna miss him? Caden has a genetic condition known as ring 22 chromosome. It affects things like his speech, but certainly not that big bright smile. Caden is so happy that it just makes you feel good about what you're doing. And it, it makes you, that's, that's, a, that's a, a big driving factor to just keep you going because you know that it brings joy to someone else. For his rock, his mother Leah. When, when people say, man, you did this, you did that. I, I give a, all the credit to her because she's the one who kept me doing what I was supposed to do. You want to make sure that they have everything that they need to get to the next level, to mm -hmm. be all that they can be. Um, but he did it. And that's what I'm most proud of. And it wasn't easy. It was very hard. And most of all, the soldier doesn't fight because he hates what's in front of him, but he loves what's behind him. For his inspiration. When I say the strongest role, I don't mean just because he's my dad. I just mean because the things, the things he instilled in me since I was so young, they were just, they were very, very real. Army Major Mike Metcalf is as real as they come. He was what they call three tab, airborne, green beret, ranger, while serving seven different tours overseas. To Cameron and his family, this man was invincible. That's until a February 2019 day while driving to a football practice. So he put his hand on the steering wheel, and then if he would let go of his hand, it'd slide off. And we were kind of laughing about it, but then as we did that for a couple days, and then he told my aunt, who's a doctor, she was like, you really need to, this is something very serious. Scan showed a rare tumor on vertebrae C4, C5. That was the picture that he sent the boys. Just two months later, a biopsy revealed stage four cancer. I mean, it was so fast. Over the next few months, Mike's condition rapidly worsened, like he had done so many times before. He wanted to fight, so that's what we did. He decided he wanted to get treatment at all costs so he could get more time. By late July, it was time to come home. Two weeks later, August 9th, 2019. She woke me up and I just knew. 40 year old Mike Metcalf died. She was like, he's gone, but you, you can talk to him. So I went out there, the paramedics were already in here. Um, he was laying there. And you know, I, I sat there for about 20 minutes, you know, just holding his hand and then Man, I looked at the time, but I was like, I gotta go to practice. So, uh, you know, I was like, if he was here, he'd, like, you get your behind at practice. So that's what he did on that day and every single one since, keeping a promise in the process. Mike always said, stay the course, right? Yeah. You gotta complete the mission. And um, this is the first mission. Yeah. So we've completed this one and we've got a lot more to go. A mission now complete with a message to his hero. What's up, Dad? It's Cam. Man, we did it. We stayed this course. We finished this mission. Two more months, I'm going to be at Columbia. You know I'm putting in work this summer. Love you.